the Lodos Production Facility, which is part of the Southern Center for Shipbuilding and Ship Repair of the United Shipbuilding Corporation, is completing preparations to dispatch the multi-purpose dry cargo vessel Kaspiski Bereg, constructed under Project RSD-49. The vessel has reached an important milestone by successfully completing sea trials carried out in the area of the Volgograd Reservoir, confirming its technical readiness for service. This event represents a significant step for Russian civil shipbuilding. The vessel has been designed according to modern principles that emphasize versatility, economic efficiency, and adaptability to a broad range of operating conditions. These characteristics are especially important at a time when transportation and logistics challenges are increasing for Russia and its international partners. Project RSD-49 is defined as a universal multi-purpose dry cargo vessel intended to transport a wide variety of cargo types. Its main advantage lies in the ability to carry both standard and specialized cargoes over long distances without the need for extensive reconfiguration for specific goods. Vessels of this project are designed to transport general cargo, bulk materials, timber, grain, oversized cargo, and hazardous goods when packed or containerized in accordance with safety standards. This wide cargo capability makes Project RSD-49 vessels particularly attractive for operators handling agricultural products as well as heavy industrial equipment. Another defining feature of the project is its support for mixed river and sea navigation. This allows the vessels to operate not only in the Caspian Sea, but also in the Mediterranean Sea, the Black Sea, the Baltic Sea, the White Sea, and the Northern Seas. By meeting dimensional and draft limitations, the vessels can navigate the Volga Baltic Waterway and the Moscow Canal, enabling efficient transport along routes that combine inland rivers with open sea passages. An essential stage in preparing the vessel for delivery was the completion of sea trials conducted under the supervision of the Russian Maritime Register of Shipping. These trials are mandatory and are intended to evaluate the vessel's operational performance, safety, and reliability of propulsion systems and onboard equipment. During testing, specialists assessed the operation of the main and auxiliary power plants, maneuverability under various operating modes, stability of machinery and ship systems, and the functioning of ballast and cargo hold systems. The successful outcome of these trials confirms the vessel's readiness for commercial operation and marks the final stage before transfer to the customer after completion and outfitting. The Lodos Shipyard, located in the Astrakhan region, is one of Russia's major civil shipbuilding enterprises and operates within the structure of the United Shipbuilding Corporation. The yard specializes in the construction of multi-purpose navigation vessels and seagoing cargo ships, including those built under Project RSD-49. The facility participates in both state-funded and commercial shipbuilding programs, including contracts with the State Transport Leasing Company, one of Russia's largest customers for civilian vessels. The contract for the construction of Kaspiski Bereg was concluded with this company, highlighting effective cooperation between government institutions and domestic industry. Modern production technologies are widely used at the shipyard, including digital design tools and three-dimensional modeling. These methods improve production efficiency, reduce construction costs, enhance build quality, shorten construction timelines, and ensure accurate implementation of design solutions. The dry cargo vessel Kaspiski Bereg has technical characteristics that define its capacity, dimensions, and operational flexibility. Its overall length is approximately 140 meters, and its beam, or width, is about 16 and a half meters. The vessel's draft varies depending on loading conditions, allowing it to operate effectively both at sea and on inland waterways. Its dead weight exceeds 7,000 metric tons in sea conditions and is more than 4,500 metric tons during river navigation. The service speed of the vessel is approximately 11.5 knots. 
Cargo is carried in large holds with a combined volume exceeding 10,000 cubic meters, while ballast tanks ensure stability under different loading scenarios. The propulsion system consists of two main diesel engines, each producing about 1,200 kilowatts of power. The vessel can operate autonomously for up to 20 days and has an approximate cruising range of 4,000 nautical miles, which is equivalent to about 7,400 kilometers. Crew accommodation is designed for 10 people with the ability to house additional specialists when required. These features make the vessel a flexible and efficient solution for cargo transport on demanding routes that combine river and sea operations. Vessels built under Project RSD-49, including Kaspiski Bereg, play an important role in strengthening Russia's transport infrastructure and expanding international logistics corridors. Their ability to link inland waterways with maritime roads ensures a steady flow of cargo both within the country and beyond its borders. Cargo transportation across the Caspian Sea, supported by routes through Azerbaijan, Georgia, and onward to the Black Sea, opens significant opportunities for export and transit shipments. These include agricultural goods, metals, and industrial products, reinforcing economic ties between regions and enabling the development of new trade routes. The successful implementation of Project RSD-49 and the commissioning of vessels such as Kaspiski Bereg provide a solid foundation for expanding Russia's merchant fleet and replacing foreign-built cargo ships. Additional civilian vessels are planned for construction at the Lotos shipyard under agreements with the State Transport Leasing Company, ensuring sustained workloads and long-term growth for the enterprise. In the context of global trends in maritime trade and logistics, vessels of the RSD-49 class are expected to become core elements of fleets operating both in Russian waters and on international routes. Their adaptability to varied geographic and climatic conditions makes them particularly valuable in complex operating environments. Project RSD-49 and the vessel Kaspiski Bereg built under this design demonstrate notable progress in Russian civil shipbuilding. The ship's versatility, modern construction techniques, and successful sea trials reflect a high standard of execution for large-scale maritime industrial projects. The Lodo Shipyard and the United Shipbuilding Corporation continue to confirm their strategic importance to the Russian economy by delivering a reliable and adaptable fleet capable of meeting modern logistics demands. If you like the video, please subscribe, share, and like. Also, please take the memberships to encourage us.